Welcome back everybody. Right, today I promised you the ultimate hidden Fire Stick feature. Fire TV feature, Fire TV Cube feature. We haven't had this in the UK. Um, it's here now. I'm not sure where around the world. Some of you have had it, some of you haven't. But it's not advertised. It's not in your settings. It's a beaut. And I'm going to show you how to access it in a minute and you're going to love this. Apologies before we get started. I am feeling a bit under the weather today. But we will grind through and I'll try and make myself understandable. Before we do that, if you like your Fire Stick videos, do hit that subscribe button. If you're a regular watcher, do hit that share button. And remember, if you are a regular watcher and you're a new watcher, drop a comment underneath letting us know if you like this video. Plus, we're asking the question today, what is your favourite film, movie? Drop it underneath below. So, most Fire Sticks, Fire TV, they all use the same user interface. And you have this, you have your features here, Home, Find, Live. And then in your settings, you have a few more features. So notifications, equipment control is kind of a feature. Live TV is a feature. Controllers and Bluetooth devices, where you can add more devices. Fine, normal devices. Alexa, can't really do much in here because it just tells you about the Alexa app. Um, displays and sounds, MiFi TV. So as features go, there's a few in here, but not one will top the smart home, okay? But you've got to access the smart home. You have to do it correctly. Um, this came from a comment under one of my videos. And I said, nope, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. And I was asking correct incorrectly. So you may have this and not know about it. So what you have to do is push the blue button on your remote for Alexa. Once you push that button, you don't need to say the name. You can just say, show smart home. And here you get to your smart home, okay? This is very cool, very interesting. Um, you have many different things in here. So you've got your lights, which is my light above, whichever you have set up. I've got my light in my office and I've got my son's room, his light as well, so I can control them from here. Um, as you'll see, my light is on, it's blue. You might not see it massively turn off because it's daytime. As it goes off, we change color. The thing you don't have control of in here is the color itself, but you do have control of the brightness. So you can go back on, we've gone blue and you can control the brightness here as well. If you want to dim it, all from your fire stick. Right, you can also have cameras. So we can connect to my Echo Show. So this is my, I've got a Google, an Amazon Echo Show here with a camera on it, which could be anywhere around your house. It could be in your kitchen, if you use it in your kitchen, anywhere like that, and you can access the camera on your fire stick. It could be a Amazon doorbell, which you can access here. It could be an Amazon smart plug. It could be anything. Okay, let's get out of that one. Smart home. Okay. You can try other devices if you want to try and search for them. You can try and... But the best way to add the devices, you add them on your phone. So you download the app. The app you need, let me just check I've got it on here, is Amazon Alexa. Okay. That's your app. You download it from your Play Store or whatever and you can add your devices. Or like I say, you can ask your Fire Stick to... Alexa, discover devices. And it can look around. I've got no more to add, but I thought this was really cool. So you can watch your cameras, you can control your light bulbs, you can control your plug sockets, which I've got a few more to put around the house, and you can do it all on your Fire Stick. Again, this is a built-in feature. You are not having to install anything. You don't have to install anything new. Just be careful. Okay? If you go... Open Smart Home. It puts you to here. And this is where I went wrong a lot. Okay, I went wrong here a lot. So this isn't what we want at all, is it? What it wants to open is Show Smart Home. If you hold the button correctly. See, it's a bit tricky to get in there. Show Smart Home. Again, would be brilliant if you have the um, if you have the doorbells, if people are at the door, if you want to turn your lights off when you're watching a movie. Everything in here is all linked in, and you can access it all from there. Which I think I'm hoping you guys like this. I don't know how many of you knew this was there. I knew it was a feature. I have not been able to access it. Let me know underneath if you have. Some of you may be thinking, "Shut up, Doc. We've had this for ages." But for me, if you go in your settings, it's not here. So you go into Alexa to find it. Alexa app. Nope. Preferences. It won't be in there. 
controllers and Bluetooth devices, your remotes, other Bluetooth devices, but it doesn't pick up any of the devices connected to your account. Equipment control, automatic, manage equipment. Still, not here, okay? So there's only one way to get it, and it is show smart home. Yes. And again, we can connect to the cameras just by clicking on them. And we're back in again. The mic's on this time. You can turn the mic off. I think. Oh, that we can minimise it though. So we're up here now. So you can continue doing what you're doing on your screen at the same time. So if that's your doorbell and you were worried about something going on outside or you had a camera you wanted to watch outside, you can have it on the top, on the overlay, while you are doing whatever you want on your Fire Stick. You could even be watching TV or anything like that and it's up there. How cool is that? Brilliant. Before we leave, as always, a quick word from me and some of my partners. Quickly, remember, if you like that video, do share it to meet other people. The more people who use it, they're gonna appreciate it. And it's a free tip to help you. Everything we do is free, remember? So do remember to hit that subscribe button. We have many videos here. We've just re reached over a million views on one video. The rest of them here are all about your streaming, okay? Whether it's movies, sports, TV, VPNs, adding apps, removing apps, tips, tricks, safety, non-buffering, everything like that is on your Fire Stick and it's all here for you, okay? Simple as that. Plus, before we leave, a quick word from one of our partners. We like to do this at the end. Obviously, we work with partners which help us give, do giveaways like we do, whether it's Fire Stick giveaways or NVIDIA Shields. We obviously work a little bit of commission from certain companies. So IP Vanish is a great VPN. If you ever wanted to support the channel, signing up to the VPN is linked directly below. This helps support the channel, plus you get a VPN in return, okay? Rather than you, say, signing up to a Patreon or a membership for us, where you don't really get anything in return, this way you get a VPN you can use on your Fire Stick, your iPhone, your Android phone, your PC, all for you underneath. So that's 3 99 a month if you're interested. Again, that is optional. You don't have to sign up, but we like to advertise them as we do partner with them. Brilliant. I've been Doc Squiffy. This is the Doc Squiffy channel. I hope you enjoyed that tip. I'll be back in a couple of days. Hopefully I'll be feeling a bit better. Remember to hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up button, drop me some comments, and I'll see you soon.